Tonight, a story we hope warms your heart on this cold night. A Coleraine Township woman recently learned this may be her very last Christmas. The cancer in her pancreas is now in her lungs. And since Mary even loves Christmas, her family and friends decided, well, she needed to have her own winter wonderland. When the doctor told me I didn't have much time and that it was uh, cancer, I said, the heck with it, and I went. That was Mary Even's attitude last week. Sick from chemo, she threw caution to the wind and hopped on a plane to New York so she could see the Christmas tree and the Rockettes. And while she was gone, a plan was hatched to secretly put some trees, maybe seven or eight, outside for Mary. I was like, we're not doing eight. Like, if we're going to do it, we're going to do it good. So instead of eight trees. I have 20 trees on my deck, four snowmen, and then I have two live trees on my front porch. About 50 friends and family secretly worked all day this past Sunday at Mary's Coleraine Township house. They put up the trees, strung the lights, so they could surprise a woman they love so much. It was so great because everyone feels so helpless, and this was such a great thing to come together and actually feel like we were doing something to make her feel better about herself and her last Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Monday night, Mary even returned from the bright lights in New York City to the glorious lights in her backyard. We pulled up to this, and I, of course I started crying like a baby. It was fabulous. I cannot tell you, like, Mary and Gary both are the most generous, caring, loving people. And they do so much for this entire family. Like, we could never, ever repay them for what they do for us. Christmas is a time for giving, for family, for friends, for embracing the special people and moments of your life. And for Mary Even and her family, a winter wonderland they will never forget. I kind of adopted a policy that I live one day at a time. And um, I, I'm not sure if this is my last Christmas, but they sure made it special for me. And uh, so it meant a lot to me. Well, I spoke with Mary tonight and she told me her doctor says she may only live months. She could live, though, a couple of years. So we're rooting for a couple more Christmases for her and a whole lot of love as she heads into, into January and endures more chemotherapy. We wish her all the best.